I don't know yet. I mean, I'm going to go and I'm going to see and we'll meet. And, you know, I don't know Paul. I've met him one time. I've liked him. I think he's a good, you know, good man. And, and I really think, you know, probably we'll come out with something that's going to be good, I hope. Otherwise, I'll just continue on the path that I continue on. Well, what do I mean? Do you envision that there'll be a point tomorrow? I know you said you just said you didn't know, but then... Where it would just be you and Paul in a room together? Or? That I don't know. I think I think there might be, but I I don't mind. He probably has a couple of people he feels comfortable with, and I do, and so it may be that way, or it may be Paul and I. And uh, you know, I think maybe more than anything else, we have to get to know each other. He knows every other candidate, you know, their politicians, sure. and he knows them. He doesn't know me, and so I think maybe to a certain extent, he wants to get to know me a little bit, and I can understand that. But we'll just have to see how it plays out, and I think it's going to play out well. And if it, you should walk in. if it doesn't, you'll be the first to know. <laughs> you should walk in and offer him the VP slot. Yeah, well. Uh, <laughs> you should throw him off. I, I so. tell you, number one, he wouldn't want it. And, and he's doing a good job where he is. You know, he wants to, uh, look, that was not an easy one to fill. That was a uh, that was a tough deal. The whole speaker thing was a tough. That was a pretty tough deal. But I, I you know, I expect I expect it's going to be certainly interesting, and I think it'll probably go well. 